And don't you have like a fear that uh, possibly, uh, you know, your art isn't getting to your audience? Like your your audience is unable to to see your art. It's not intended to, man. It's not supposed to reach an audience. My audience is nature, okay? Nature is like my like art gallery visitor or art goer or something like that, you know? I don't need to have my art seen by anybody and I don't want it to be seen by anyone, okay? So there's no fear at all. No. Then why are you part of this uh, this exhibition? Oh. <sighs> because hidden art cannot be escaped. It's reality within this world we live in because it's true art, okay? And no matter where I go, no matter where I hide, I'll always be found. And people will just look at me and like say, Wow. But the real ones who appreciate it will be like, won't say anything. And they'll take off their clothes, like me, and go up to another tree and wrap their nature around a tree and feel our heart beats, you know, um, one with nature. And like, it's even more beautiful. So, so. So, like, what you're saying is that uh, there's times when groups of people join you in your little oh, excursion? Yes, it's the most beautiful experience you will ever encounter. It's, like, better than any dead show that I went to, man. It's, like, better than anything. Just, like, all these people around there just, like, hugging trees and, like, not doing anything except breathing. Breathing with the wind, with the flow. Of, of of life, you know, so it, that, that's what I'm trying to promote here, and that's why I'm here. I had to pick up, like, everything I had right here, my tent, and, like, my unart stuff, and, like, move out here, and, like, you know, set up camp. It was really, really kind of tough, but, you know, I... Like, okay, I'm going to produce some hidden art for you right now, okay? Is that okay? Let me just give you a little example. Okay. How's that? I, I didn't see you do anything. You exactly. You did not see. It was hidden. It was within my soul. That's that's absolutely fascinating. Thank um, you, thank you. See now, we could do this together, and it would just be cosmic, you know. That's what I'm promoting here. You know, I don't want to push you beyond your bounds or anything like that. But that's what I'm here for, man. I have an internet internet site out there, but you know what, man? You can't find it. You can't find it if you look for it. What, what, why is why is that it? Because the internet site and all its web pages that are attached to it are hidden. So you don't. Uh, <clears throat> nobody ever goes to your site. Basically, yeah. Don't don't you see? There's a little contradictory. <laughs> being uh, supposed to be a hidden art, but then you're going into a medium, uh, putting art into a medium that is probably like the most widely used medium uh, in the world, and exposing yourself, not, not just nationally, but internationally, into millions in, upon millions of homes every day. So the what's your question, man? That's art right there, because there is a question there that I did not hear. Um, so I'm gonna answer it with you, man. Okay, uh, my question being, uh, I, you're gonna go onto the internet, yet the uh, it's supposed to be hidden art. Yet you're using a medium that's the most widely used medium today. You did it again, man. You're beautiful. All right.
Why did you, you get don't? that? No. So at this point now, you're commissioning somebody to do your hidden art. And yet it's supposed to be hidden yet you have somebody else doing it. <sighs> Somebody's doing it. I don't know who they are. I can't see them. I've never talked to them, but somebody's doing it. Yeah, because how can it be your art? It's nature's art. It's not my art. It's just art. Art is art. Okay, then. Art is hidden art. Nice art. <laughs> yes, um, I guess I'm just a, a bit um, confused by this whole you know, take on art here. You're talking how you don't want people to see your work yet. Oh, You're nice putting your work on the computer yet. You don't know who's doing your own artwork yet. It's not yours, it's nature's. Uh, you seem to be doing a lot of um, incoherent babbling as far as I'm concerned. Uh, could you, like... I mean, is yes. there any way you can clarify what uh, what you're talking about? Um, what? I'm waking up, man. I'm just like, art is taking over within me. Okay, so, all right, man. Cool. Cool, man. All right. So what's up? Um... Obviously nothing, because I've been asking you questions for like 20 minutes now, and you haven't uh, given me a, a clear answer on anything. Art um, is timeless, baby. Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, you say you go out into, uh, oh, say the woods yes. or um, whatnot, and you get naked and... Uh, see, I'm already naked, though. That's the thing. Right, but we don't want to see that. Uh, yeah, but I mean, you don't get naked. You are entered into this world naked, and with an umbilical cord. Which, man, if I could change this world, I would have every newborn baby take his umbilical cord with him home, um. because the, it's supposed to be attached. You know, it's not supposed to, like, be cut off or anything like right. that. But wouldn't it eventually rot and fall off on its own? Yeah. But you might be able to, like, keep it because it's hidden. Um, I, I see you have a painting behind you there. Could you could you just explain that other painting back want... behind you, the bigger one there? Oh, yeah. Maybe you could talk a little bit so, you know, about uh, uh, something that we could all actually kind of understand. Yeah, people do not relate to art at all. This is on art right here. Um, at the time, I was on some masculine, and uh, I was like really pissed off and stuff. And I didn't realize it was like my uh, un unconscious uh, art that was like creating this absurd, um, morbid kind of, sp I don't even know, cultic picture, man. Um, what, 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 can you explain the painting? Like, what, what were you thinking at the time? There seems to be a lot of. Uh, deep orange and red hues and very kind of violent gestures uh, in juxtapositions within that, that composition there. Uh, you know, the man's mouth and eyes being blacked out and the uh, rabbit dog between his uh, legs there uh, uh, seemingly representing his uh, crotch. Um, yes, yeah. Maybe you could just give us a little insight into that. Well, you see, I've been transformed and I no longer understand the unart. I can't understand unart. So why I bring these along with me is to is to discover the hidden art. His eyes. That's art. You know why? Because you can't see them. His mouth. You can't see them. The dog's body is beautiful. It's not even there.